your problem? Why don't I have fucking problems with? The Oracle for one, the sea for another, and don't get me started on my crew. You have business with the Oracle? You're a long way from Delphi. Had business. And my business is none of your fucking business. I ain't shopping for a merc. If anything, I need the gods. You need a god? I'm the next best thing. Oh, you're a live one. That's a good pitch. I'll give you that. So who are you? Captain Yellon of the Shark's Tooth. Shark Tooth's your boat? Do I look like a fucking fisherman? I sail a ship, not a boat. It was just a question. I'm here to help. Oh, it's not your fault. After my business with the Oracle, I came to meet my ship and crew. That was a day ago, and they're nowhere to be found. So where is the shark's tooth? I wouldn't fucking be here if I knew, would I? Okay, let me rephrase. Where was the crew meant to be? Well, um... I sent my girl Yiki off. Pilgrims get stuck in the shallows around here, and, uh... We... Sort of help out. Oh, your girl? Yeah, best hand I ever had, and more. Look, find my ship and my Yiki, will you? I'll pay. I'll find out what happened, and bring them back. I'll find them and return as soon as I can. Come <laughs> on. 
Cassandra, what are you doing here? I could ask you the same. Well, here I am. Though I'm more curious about how you are here. The gods let you in? We've known each other a long time now. You know how I got in here. You've taught me that the blade can sometimes be necessary. But I don't think this was one of those times. I was worried about you. Your care is appreciated. But if you had waited only a bit longer, I'm sure my trial would have taken place and I'd be free. You're not going to trial. We're getting you out of here. I understand your concern, but what good would escaping do other than prove I'm guilty? No. In fact, I'm looking forward to this trial. What if they find you guilty and your punishment is severe? That will never happen. I'll convince them I deserve to go free. You'll see. What were you arrested for? I haven't the slightest idea. And that doesn't bother you? Sometimes understanding does not come at the moment we would like. More importantly, this is giving me the necessary time to think. About? I went to see the Pythia. And she told me there is none wiser than me. An intriguing thought, and one I've been unable to stop thinking about. Socrates, the Pythia is... It matters not what you believe she is or she isn't. I must examine not only her words, but my own self as well. I know nothing, so how could I be called wise? What does that have to do with being locked up? I believe my time here and this trial may help me find the answer. I will be fine. Trust me. I've known you for a while now. That's true. And you'd call us friends? I would. And friends share important things with one another. Is that so? It is. Then how did I not know you were married? I, uh... From what you just said, that means either we're not friends, or that friends don't share with one another. So, which is it? <laughs> I've wondered how much of our conversation you've taken to heart. And now, I have my answer. Were you doing anything when you got arrested? If speaking my mind is worth imprisonment, then I suppose I was. In the future, you may want to be more careful. You risk life and limb every time you draw your blade. Just because it's my tongue that is sharp, doesn't mean I'm not prepared to face the consequences of using it. Since you won't live with me, I'll go see the Pythia myself. That's not necessary. I'll find out why she told you that. I won't let you go to trial, even if you think you'll be found innocent. Ah, Cassandra, you... I'll come back when I have what I need. What's happening?